All right, time to play some H3 VR. Uh, we've got a small update today, uh, mostly for the um, simplified control users, so not much for us regular players out there, but Anton did give us this uh, new toy right here, the uh, AK Draco, or is it the Draco AK? <clears throat> and yeah, it's a very chopped down version of the AK. Uh, uses regular... AK standard magazines, actually. Let me go and see what kind of magazines. Wait, hold on, I don't think we can use the uh, 7.4U. No, no, that's not gonna work. Uh, no, 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 no. Where is it? I'm trying to find all of the uh, AK compatible magazines in here. I hope that's the VZ8. No, that's not. That's not going to work. All right. The 101, I don't think, uh, will fit. No. I'm trying to remember. Uh, AK-12. Will that work? No. <laughs> Another shot. Good. AK-12 prototype. Pretty sure. No. AK-74. No. All right. Of course, the AKM magazines will work, as uh, with the uh, drum mag here. So that's good. Tactical small. Give us a. Oh. You want a tiny? Tiny little mag for you. Actually, works a lot better. And then you got the regular tactical, which would work as well. All right. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is a different tactical magazine. One of the longer ones. Yep. So that will work. Okay, cool. Obviously, this one will work. Uh, AKM magazines. Yep, we already got one of those. No. Uh, let's see, what else can we get here? Nope, 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 nope. Nope. No, no, that's not going to work. I'm trying to think of what else. Uh, oh, the VZ58 won't work. There's the Draco AK. If you're looking for it in the item spawner, it's in the assault rifle uh, category. It's over on the uh, third page. Um, yeah, I think that's all the magazines, right? You got the classic, which uh, we will fire off. Get these smaller magazines. Ignore that grenade there because that's there for reasons. So let's, uh, let's get our target here. Let's get a, uh, silhouette. Okay. We'll just do three meters. Close, oop, <laughs> and uh, let's check it out. We got the eight, like, like I said, we got the Draco, got the classic standard AK mag. Safety is on the right or left of the touchpad, so full auto, semi auto. Let's start in semi auto. Oh, you know what? completely forgot. I should actually do this uh, HD spectator style. Enable that just to make sure. Okay. And uh, we're on the left eye. There we go. Of course, let's do a uh, tactical reload using the, uh, the tactical mag here. A full auto this time. Hmm. All right. And then we got the other tactical mag, which is not as big. And then we got the tiny, tiny tactical mag. Oop, that's my computer. Probably giving me an error or something. No, that's not an error sound. <laughs> 
It's a notification sound. Let's aim for the head this time. Oh, not that many bullets there. And of course, we've got the drum mag, which was added. Uh, when was it added? I can't remember when it was added, but it was added. And uh, it's, uh, you know, there's a lot to this one. So, you know what? Let's go and check out what kind of attachments I can put on this thing. So, uh, I tried, the reason why the grenade is there is I tried putting the um, grenade launcher. No, no dice. It's a little too short. You can tell. And also, Anton confirmed on the Discord and the uh, subreddit that you can't use the uh, cool new 4s for it, because obviously it's too short. It's got kind of a different uh, profile to it, but that's fine, because we can still customize this thing. All right. So, um, obviously, we've got the dovetail mount. That will work, but we can take that off. Come on controllers bumping into each other. Got the uh, Cobra on here. There we go. A little... Huh. Feels like it's a little high. Oh no, it's okay. Uh, I was just holding it wrong. Cobra on there. Of course we can get the uh, PK divs. Which, oh man, this is hard to do. Let me just grab this here. This will be better right here. That's how you do it. Oh, yeah. I like that red dot. Simple, simple red dot. Wait, I think, uh, was it the Cobra that you could change the... Uh... Oh, there we go. That's how you do the zero distance. Okay. Yeah, you could change the, retic the reticle on the Cobra. It's a little uh, switch over here. Uh, your interaction uh, sphere lights up, so you'll know when you hit it. But I kind of like the chevron. Where is it? Oh, no. It was working a while ago. Now it's not working anymore. Was it over here? No. Oh, there it is. Kind of like the chevron with a dot. This side up, <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's that's the Cobra. Uh, the PK divs. I don't think you can do anything with that. You get the PS PSO one. I'm trying to remember correctly. Nice long range scope. But if the dark is too dark for you, then you can enable the illuminated. Uh, Sight. There we go. Little switch here. Tick. But people already knew that, probably, right? Hopefully, you guys knew that. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, you know, you can you can do long range if you want. Oh wait, hold on. Can you? Oh, you can zero this. Okay, cool. And uh, of course, we'll put a suppressor on there. Gigantic suppressor. I mean, this gun is pretty short, so let's let's add a little bit of a uh, length to this. <laughs> by uh, putting a gigantic Russian-style suppressor on it. The uh, S SR... Um, oh my goodness, I can't, for, I, I can't remember what the suppressor was. It was... Um, it was... I'm trying to remember what gun that was. Was that the uh, PD... PDW... I think it was. No, wait a minute. Oh man, there are so many guns in this game. I I can't keep track of them all. And it's really bugging me. I, I really want to remember what that was. I think it might be in Carbine. Mm, there it is. There it is. The uh, SR3M. So that's where the suppressor comes from. So we'll just stick that on there. Oh, um, I need a sight. I think I might go with the Cobra. I like the Cobra. Cobra's nice. Uh, also, zero distance. I think I might change the zero to about five meters. Huh. Okay. You know what? No, no, no. We'll go ten meters. 
Uh, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's uh, move on to the uh, stock here. We can go with a wooden stock. There's an attach point in the back. Anton kind of showed that off. Huh, not bad. Kind of like that look. The Bergman stock. Although, if you want to go a little modern, we could go with a... Um, Hmm. Yeah. Not bad. Kind of like that as well. Kind of the wrong color, but... Um... Oh, artillery? <laughs> no, that's okay. Not really digging that. A Luger. Barbine. The Mauser stock. Hmm. Kind of like the Bergman. Honest with you. It's not too long. So, you know. I might stick with that. That's pretty cool. All right. Uh, what else can we put on here? Oh, you know what? Let me uh, get rid of one of these. Stay there. Don't move. I think it's going to fall off. Nope, it's not. All right. Let's see. Barrel extenders. Where are you? I'm looking for you. Rail adapters. Let's go with a four. Four position. There go. Stick this on there. Looks pretty good. How about a laser? Let's do a... Hmm. And a clash light. We'll do a... Wait, this one has a light, right? No, it doesn't. Oh, okay. And we'll do a clash light then. There you go. Oh, you know what? Should put a grenade launcher on this thing. Yeah, no, forget about it. Let's not do a grenade launcher. Let's just uh, keep it like this. Uh, what else? What else can we put on this thing? Grip? Should we put a grip? No. No, let's not put a grip on this. Well, I would like to put a grenade launcher on this. Maybe I'll just move this to the top like that. Since we're not going to use those iron sights, we're going to use the uh, you need the red dot. And I'm going to put a hmm, AP-25? Oh, come on, you can do it. Nope. Get on there. You can do it. There we go. No, no, come on. Hmm. A little too far forward, right? Just get up. There we go. Yeah, that's okay looking. All right. Stick our grenade on there. And get the safety up. There we go. All right. Oh, I should put a bipod. <laughs> no, forget about it. All right. So we've got ourselves our uh, beautiful looking weapon here. We got our target over there. Got a nice drum mag. And the dogs are barking outside because somebody's outside. Oh, I'll let somebody else handle that. Right now, I gotta shoot off this grenade. So let's clear this target and go max distance. Reset the target. Okay. 
That is about, what, 30 meters? Let's actually sight this. Oh, this is so hard. Hold on. Oh, no, I changed my reticule. 25, 50, you know what, we'll go 25. Well, I changed the reticle, so that's fine. All right. I'll fire off this grenade. Ah, I think I missed. But that's okay. We got more grenades. Need to go a little bit higher. There we go. I think that was a hit. Let's reset. Yeah, that was definitely a hit. No, oh, come on. There we go. But yeah, that's the uh, Draco. Well, this is my bastardized version of the Draco. Uh, I'm sure somebody else will probably make something even more horrific and uh, insane. But uh, yeah. Pretty cool. I kind of like it. Although... I'll say that, and then I'll use it in, like, Taken Hold, and it's going to be, like, <laughs> really hard to use because it's it's a really uh, recoil on this thing. Oh, man. But, yeah, that's pretty cool. Again, really small update today. Not not much. Oh, I should save this. Um, where's my Where's my suppressor? I need to put this back on. I didn't even turn on the light, did I? Uh, laser. There we go. Oh, yeah, I guess my uh, graphic settings are a little too low for that many lights. But uh, I need to put a magazine on this thing. Let's put the tactical. All right, now let's throw that one away. Oh, nope. Yeah, whatever. I just need to put one in here. There we go. All right. Stick that onto the thing. I don't have many guns saved right now, but one of them's gonna be the Draco. All right. So what else should I do? You know what? There was a post I saw. Somebody made a competition, and uh, I want to try it. I'm not going to win, but it's always interesting to see. But you have to be in the Arizona range. Let's get things to load. Let's actually clear this stuff out. Got the guns, everything. All right, so basically, it's a shooting competition. Yeah, get out of here. All these attachments. It's a shooting competition, basically. You have to use the stock Desert Eagle 50 AE. No attachments, just the Desert Eagle itself in a magazine. You can spawn lock. And the... Um, you'll see why we need this, but we need the uh, AWM. Right, uh, and uh, I forgot what scope it was. It was uh, I thirty-five. Was a uh, thirty-five power? That's as high as you can go. Which there's only I think one that really goes up that high, which is uh, the eight by thirty-two. Let me just check here. 20. I mean, there is a higher power scope in here. The um, 60 times. <clears throat> but we're just going to use the default scope right here. Let me actually the safety off on this thing. Right there. 
Uh, all right, so the details are basically you stay in this general area. Actually, you want to move this down a bit because we're going to be shooting some bottles here. You want to stay in this general area, firing line. You can't move. You can't move over here, but you have to stay here. And you have to shoot all these bottles. All the watermelons. All the dueling trees. And then those dueling trees over there, you can take with a sniper rifle. So, um, yeah, that's the, that is the challenge. And I wanted to do it. I don't know if I have enough, if, uh, if I have enough time or if it's going to be interesting to anybody out there. I can't see how much time I have, but, uh, that's what I wanted to do. And, um, you know what? Also, you can also use the um, one of the attachments. Sorry, one of the attachments. One of the um, one of the tools you could use is the hover bench. So basically, you can pre-site your your AWM. Okay, wait, hold on. Wait a minute. Let me just set this up. Because I need to stay in this area, right? Because what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to zero this thing. Oops. Nope, I don't want you there. I want you here. Zero rotation. All right, I'm going to have to... Uh, let's see. What am I going to do here? Turn on the mag... Okay, where are you, dueling trees? There's one right there. Should be one. Hmm. Wait a minute. Oh, no, those are... <laughs> I was like... What are those holes? Okay, now that's just the um, that's just the crosshair. Ooh, man, that's a little too sensitive. All right, I'm gonna try to shoot the uh, center of these things because I don't want to have to waste my time on shooting the things back. I just need to zero this thing. So this is about that's two. That's ten. That's fifteen. Uh, not a hundred. I think the first one of these trees is a hundred. Right? The, there's one, two, three. That's a hundred. So a hundred and fifty, two hundred meters. Right? I want to say two hundred meters. Okay. Looks like we hit it. Uh, you know what? I'm going to have to go shoot one of those things, so. Ooh, no. We are a little bit... I think we might need to go a little... A little high here. Okay, okay. I got it, I got it. So we need to adjust the windage to go, oh sorry, uh, elevation, Oops. come on, elevation to go down, I'm going to go down about, two minutes of angle, there we go. All right, so, but it is, like, to be completely honest, it is set for that distance, 250 meters at least, I think. But I'm going to have to be shooting the 100-meter one, so I might have to re-zero. Let's see. I need a bipod as well, so <laughs> I actually need a bipod. 
So let's grab ourselves a bipod. I, I, I think the competition states that you can use the, um, the, uh, the sled, but I think it's a lot faster if I use a bipod. Completely honest. So we're just going to get ourselves a bipod. Where is it? There it is. All right, about this height. Okay. All right, let me just see if I can... Oh, I need to find it first. I don't know where it is. Too close on the magnification here. There it is. I see it. Oh, this is going to be really bad. I think maybe I should have used a sled. I'm making things harder on myself here. I need to. It'd be better if I was sitting down. Because my body is swaying. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Oh, this is tough, man. I think I might need the sled for this. Okay, yeah. No, this is... This is hard. Completely missed that one. Goodness, I can't get it to move over this way. <sighs> I didn't hit it. All right. Well, this is going to be pretty tough. I think you might need the sled for this. Oh. Uh. the rotation also let's uh, actually reload this oh oh yeah this is I am it's right there okay I see it so we're set at 200 meters at 26 minutes of, oh, sorry, 26, at two minutes of angle. What about the uh, closer targets here? This one should be 100 meters, right? Where am I going to shoot with this? Oh, yeah, I definitely missed that one. So if I just take this off. Oops, uh, 100 meters. That is 100 meters, okay. Which I need to push back, hold on just a second. Let me put this back. All right, I need to go up. So just straight 100 meters. Not too bad on the... This one is 150, I think. I'm not too sure. It would be nice if I had a rangefinder. That's okay. Oh, I keep getting notifications for some reason. Whatever. Oops. Hundred and fifty. I think I might need to pull this up a bit. 
Yep, okay, 150. Elevation is about to... All right, cool. So 150 base, base zero, no elevation. Then when I get to the second one, I'll adjust it to 150, two minutes of angle. And then when I get to the third one, I'll adjust it to um, 200 meters with two minutes of angle. Okay, I'll do that. Okay, cool. All right, let's just set this up. Go down. Go to the right. Okay, that's set there. We're good. Okay. Oh, man, this is blocking the dueling tree. Well... Well, anyways, this is not really a serious attempt at anything. I'm just really like, you know, um, whatchamacallit. I'm workshopping things, you know, just uh, seeing if it could be done by me. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to do it, but whatever. Let's just try it out. So, got bottles here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's one mag. Reload. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Reload. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Reload. One, two. Reload. No, 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 no. Hold on. Seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Reload. Huh. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Um, also, I'm trying to remember. 100 meters, 150, 2 minutes of angle, 200, 2 minutes of angle. Okay, I just I need to remember. <laughs> this is terrible. I don't think I'm going to do a legit run for this, but I'm going to try to attempt it. This is bad. Mmm. I need more practice. Come on, give this to me. Oh, I'm just going to preemptively reload. Tough. Just can't get that. There we go. I can drop this. Okay. Oops. My goodness. Are you. What? What's going on there? Okay, uh, go down. Oh, 
Okay. Oops. Ah. Oh, wait. That was 100. Ah, well, that's fine. I didn't change it. I just need two minutes of angle. Alright, I need to move this up. Oh, yeah. There you are. I see ya. 32 times. That's good enough. Up. Oh. Okay, uh, this is now 200 meters. Need to move up. Where is it? Up and to the left. Up. Oops. Need to go up. Up. And to the left. Where is it? Oh, my goodness. That's not it. Wait, did I accidentally hit that? I think I hit that one. Oh no. <laughs> okay, well. Yeah, I might have to redo all this. Okay, this is pretty tough. Okay. This might be. I think I might have left it. Uh... Oh, man. Huh. Maybe. I think I did it wrong. <laughs> Oh, well, this is invalid already. Hmm. Let's try three. Nope. I think that's a little too high. It's a little too high. All right, I think I need to take that uh, this down. Yeah. Okay. Maybe that's why. Ouch! Well, oh, this is a terrible time. Yeah, okay. That was 150. Yeah, I think I might have made a mistake there. <laughs> but uh, you see, that's the challenge. Get all the bottles, get all the watermelons, all the, du the dueling trees. These three are easy, but that one is pretty hard. And then uh, <laughs> those three down there. But yeah, I mean, if you want to do that, if you have HDVR and want to fancy a try at this, it's doesn't take that long to set up. Oops, did I uh, lose one? Go back. There we go. Yeah, these close ones are really easy. Except for that one. Ooh. Oh, 
come on. Must have had a glancing shot. There we go. <laughs> so many magazines. But uh, yeah, if you want to give this a try, you can do that yourself. Remember, all the bottles, all the watermelons, dueling trees, and then long range. Um, but yeah. Oh man, it's terrible today. I'll put the safety on it. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, no. Just need to practice. That one I need a lot of practice on. Oh. <laughs> All right, I think that should be about it today. All right, did I lose my, uh, oh, I must have lost my my AWM. That's okay. But uh, like I said, that's about it for today. And a uh, very short update. Uh, not much. But uh, Meat Miss is coming up real fast. I think it's probably uh, one more week. All right, we get next week and then the 1st of December is when the Meat Miss update drops. So, oh, you bet I'm going to cover that. Uh, new gun every day. This is going to be uh, quite a challenge. I did that like 2018? Meet Miss 2018, right? No, 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 wait, wait. Yeah, 2018. 2019 was um, the Kappa Coliseum. Today's 2020. So, yeah. It's going to be uh, Advent style, Advent calendar style. So, that's going to be really, really crazy. I'm going to have to do a video every day. <laughs> oh, man. Or I can do one every week. You know what? I think I might do it every day. But, yep, Meat Miss. 1st of December, which is coming up soon. So, it's going to be uh, pretty cool. And, uh, anyways, I will see you guys next time.